Passivity. Passivity is a term used to describe a state of inaction or lack of activity. It refers to the tendency to accept or allow things to happen without taking action or showing initiative. In the context of language, passivity can be seen in the way we communicate and understand the English language. Passivity can be observed in various aspects of language, such as listening, reading, and speaking. Here are some examples to illustrate the concept. 1. Listening passivity. When we listen passively, we simply receive information without actively engaging with it or trying to understand it deeply. For instance, imagine you are in a lecture and the speaker is discussing a complex topic. If you are passively listening, you might just hear the words without making an effort to comprehend the meaning behind them. Example. You overhear a conversation between two people discussing a movie. Even though you can hear the words, you are not actively trying to understand the plot or the characters. 2. Reading passivity. Reading passively involves going through a text without actively analyzing or critically engaging with the content. This can happen when we read for leisure or when we skim through a text quickly without paying attention to the details. Example. You are reading a newspaper article about a recent political event, but you are only scanning the headlines and not delving into the details or comprehending the implications of the news. 3. Speaking passivity. Speaking passively refers to expressing oneself without putting much thought or effort into the words and phrases used. It often involves using cliches or generic phrases without adding personal opinions or engaging in meaningful conversations. Example, when asked about your opinion on a controversial topic, you respond with a generic statement like, I don't really have an opinion, or I don't know, it's complicated, without elaborating or expressing your thoughts clearly. It is important to note that passivity can hinder effective communication and understanding. To overcome passivity, active engagement is crucial. This can be achieved by actively listening and asking questions to clarify information, reading attentively and reflecting on the content, and expressing oneself with clarity and depth in conversations. In conclusion, Passivity in language refers to a lack of active engagement or initiative in listening, reading, and speaking. By actively participating in these language activities, we can enhance our understanding and communication skills.